So just finished 30 full minutes in the sauna, which I gotta tell you, is not pleasant. I'm sure you guys know that. But I'm gonna keep going up for this week, acclimate, and then the next two weeks try to do at least one hour, maybe one hour twice a day in the sauna because I don't own my own sauna. I'm not rich enough to do that yet. But when I do, um, I will make sure it's at the right temperature. So I can't make sure it's at the right temperature all the time. But one thing I can control is how long I'm in there. And the longer you're in there, the more benefit you're supposed to get. Now that doesn't mean go in for 10 hours. It doesn't mean go in there with a suit on to try to get the most sweat on. You are trying to get that hormetic effect of raising your body temperature. And that's where the heat shock proteins come from and all the benefits come from. Um, but don't try to kill yourself doing it. This is my self experiment. What I'm going to do is test hormone levels before I do these extended sessions in the sauna for a short period of time and then hormone levels levels after and I'm gonna do a very controlled set of workouts and exercises to see did I improve as well in some of the cardio workouts over time because that's supposed to be another benefit as well we'll see um, so I'm gonna increase my sauna usage over the next three months this is my health and longevity and I guess fitness benefit as well and I'm gonna do experimentations every month on different things that I can give you guys tips and tricks on um, that you can do for short periods of time because this is highly stressful if you're gonna do anything like this you have to check with your doctor first um, but let me do it first and see you know if I die maybe you shouldn't do it um, if I don't die and I get some great benefits and I see some great hormonal benefits and I see some great workout benefits then maybe you do try it um, but always consult with your doctor first and let's see what's the best thing for you and we can always work on that as well all right so I will keep you guys posted thanks for sticking with me love you one other thing I forgot to tell you guys is even after that first 30 minutes I came out and I jacked up the heat in my car it is 96 degrees out now and my car is at 90 that's the highest it'll go um, so that I can keep that hormetic effect um, which my, means my body temperature raised as long as I possibly can and stand it. Um, so it keeps a little bit, I think, of the heat shock proteins from what I've read. We'll see. Maybe Rhonda Patrick will tell me if I'm wrong or not about that. Um, and then I'm heading to Whole Foods. So that should be a pleasant experience for all the shoppers around me. Let's look good naked for life. <laughs>